So tell everybody how you kind of figured out this inflammatory reflex and what it is. And then we can go into the vagus nerve itself and get a little bit more because I think you laid it out in your book extremely well about how it's very, I don't know if a nerve can be eloquent, but it's pretty eloquent. Inflammatory reflex is a reflex in the vagus nerve that connects the brain to your immune system and functions like the brakes on your car. It slows down inflammation, and that's the connection to rheumatoid arthritis. In rheumatoid arthritis, there's too much inflammation, and the drugs we have to treat rheumatoid arthritis are immunosuppressive. They have serious side effects, and they don't. the drugs are not effective in all patients. In fact, they're probably only effective in about half of patients. There's a recent survey with the significant dissatisfaction of many, many rheumatoid arthritis patients with their current drugs. So that's the link between inflammation and rheumatoid arthritis. And we'll come back to where we are now with the recent approval by the FDA to target this story using a computer chip to treat rheumatoid arthritis patients by targeting the inflammatory reflex. And you, you asked where it came from. Well, like many good stories in science, it came to us by surprise. 